Hello and welcome everyone again to a, another episode by 20 Italians of the uh, search for the Seo Cheyenne, the, uh, the quest for the Seo Cheyenne achievement. Um, we left off last time as the, my arrival, uh, the former high chief of Utukan, Chief Burkan, as he died, he became incapable, and then he died comatose in bed, as you can see in 782. So now his son, who is not of age, who is only th who is 13, so he's going to be in power soon. Um, he is going to. Uh, he is now leading uh, the very large chiefdom of Utukan. Uh, as you can see right here, uh, I am still playing as Tengri Bo Boku. He hasn't died yet. Ruling over Yugur, which s s spans from the Kyrgyz and Altai border all the way to the end of the map. I'm still focusing my efforts here on Yurabo. Um, I really want to take it over. It's both rich as well as um, just give me an, uh, expand my territory. I still have to deal with the fact that uh, Otukan most of the rest of my um, my tribal lands here are are not Manichaean. Um, so you can see right here, the only Manichaean are three provinces, two of them which are mine. And uh, all the rest are Tengri. And some of them are ruled by uh, Manichaeans, such as Altai and Kyrgyz. I have another daughter boy to my wife. So it's actually my daughter. Very good. I have a couple concubines. There you go. Oh, good. My concubine makes me feel less <laughs> less stressed. And there you go. No wonder I was less stressed. Uh, the chief down here is also a Manichaean. The only one who's not Manichaean is this family up here, the, the Bayad dynasty. They're not Manichaean, and it's uh, been a uh, thorn in my side here as, yeah, he might like me now, but as soon as he gets to become of age, he's going to hate me because I'm an infidel in his eyes. Jewish exile. Well, let's see what Nakam can bring to the table. Where's Nakam? All right, that's exactly what I needed to hear. So now I'll move him. So that's going to help the majority of the population there. Should I keep on in Otukan because he's got the biggest? Um, Let's look at let's look at economy here. Uh, everything's still in the red. Very poor, <laughs> very poor. And that's also why I want Yurabo down here. You see, it's not it's not poor. And actually, I, I want to kind of take all of this right here. I want to expand south before I expand west uh, because it's it is uh, more fertile lands down here. Um, just seeing how far it goes. But most of the step is poor. It's just not poor, it's it's dirt poor. Actually, this is dirt poor all the way up until uh, West Francia. So if you're wondering what was happening over here, uh, West Francia has taken over. Um, so that's going to create a, a great block uh, until probably the uh, uh, King Maynard dies. But I need to worry about my little slice of, uh, slice of light over here. Oh, how do I figure out? How am I gonna look? Point eight, point eight, point seven, point five. I'm looking at the, the county tax here. Ooh, one, but that's because they are Manichaean. Three, two and a half. And I've built up mine. How about Kyrgyz? So maybe I will try for try for Gorgol. It's not because it's like 0.6. Which I get 0.6. So can I get more? Why is it... Uh, can't. I need to 
village, but I need to save money for the fabrication of claims down in Yorabo. Um, I guess I'll worry about my own before I continue with, uh, with the chief here. Why does any of his siblings adopted Manichaeism? Be no. That's unfortunate. They'll get what's coming to them. Um, see, I can have a pretty big domain, so it's not like I'm hurt for anything here. I'm going to try to take, like I said, Yoravo, Turtan. Uh, my kid's maid, who's my nephew, skilled tennis statistician. Let's get him a nice wife, get him producing. I think I can make him a commander, which is helpful because I hardly have any commanders. Wow, did you see that? Oh, I wish it should be my life. That was stewardship of 19. Oh good, all my all my <laughs> all my vassals are becoming having absolute control and I can only have low because they all hate me and they're all they don't have any vassals so they can raise the centralization as much as they want. Um who's he helped by? He's still helped by this kid. I guess I can't ask that kid to release him. I think it's because he is a child, but he's almost dead anyways. He's infirm and he's in jail. There you go. And now he's dead. He died in the dungeons, yes, as I told you. So his son... Why didn't he take over? Duke Tardish. I have had a long reign. I'm just looking here. He is only four. His regent, however, very good. He wants to gain a title, which means that he may revolt against his brother. I got nothing for you, man. I'm sure they have claim to Kyrgyz, seeing that that is the name of their their, ch their uh, tribal land, their, their duchy, I guess if you would call it that. Uh, still waiting for this to trigger down here. There's a son. Let's see my title losses here. Yeah, I only have one son. I only have two sons born from my, from my wife, so all the concubine sons don't really matter. Oh, that's right. I wanted to make... Uh, Commanders. No, I still can't do it. Hey, that's really annoying. So my son, my heir, is trying to fabricate claims. I can only help him out. Maybe if he would just go and do it, he could uh, still get the show on the road. My other counselors are seeing construction. I'm not doing any construction can't settle any tribes anywhere. I'll be able to settle it down here, I believe, once I take Yurabo. Um, don't want to build my legend because those warriors, if they don't do anything, I'll lose prestige. He's proselytizing up a big owl. I can't raid. I've tried it multiple times. It's a very slow achievement to obtain with the steps. I guess I could have gone with someone uh, deeper in Persian, Manichaean, but like I said before, they're already ruled by um, Muslims, so that wouldn't have worked out very well. I'm pretty sure they just would have taken my titles. And my spy master brings more stuff to the table. Good. I can upgrade. Yeah, upgrade shipbuilding. That's really going to help me. Woohoo! Extra martial. Right, let's see here. Cultural advances. That they need to like me more. Uh, 
So I'm still trying to figure out here what's actually I can use. I know I can build a temple, so that would help me if I ever get to that much money that I can build a temple. Some construction can help me. See a town here, Market City, three and four. Uh, it will help out here later, so I can wait on that because I'm not going to upgrade those for a little bit. So I'm going to go with construction, speed up construction. Um, definitely going to go with siege. Um, my military right now is made up of. Hey, I'll find it. I'll get to it. Light infantry. There's no reason for uh, heavy entry. I only have 25. We'll do that. I don't even think the Buddhists down there have a very big um, Oh, there goes my spy master. I was they don't have a very high siege rating, I would think. Maybe I should check that out before I attack him. Spy master, who should I take now? Denied my wife again. And I have him come to me. She made him up to nine. She'd like me more. She, she was fired. Wish I could make her the court chaplain because she has 13. She's the highest in, the, in my realm. I'll go with her. Go to this guy, get him married. Make him like me even more, be in my debt to like cause arrange his marriage. Yeah, you should be happy with that. There comes my save here. So that was my uncle who died. He's still Tengri. And I guess I could have kept the core chapel in there and hoped to um, hope to convert him as well to Manichaeism, but uh, we'll, 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 we'll make it happen eventually. We'll, we'll breed the Tengris out. Two nubile concubines, and I thought I had three, which does that mean that one of them is not nubile anymore? No, I only do have two. 30 and 39, so she's getting ready to be. Ah, okay, 1.86. Falconer is expecting. Of course, I'm going to go hunt. I'm a falconer after all. There we go. Grandson born. He named him after me. That is not very nice of him. Uh, well, she's still a nubile concubine. Yeah, I still have two times two. I'll wait. Uh, oh, I can? Commander of Yugur. Alright, yeah, I really don't think I can. Game. Oh, there's more! <laughs> wow! That was really bad of me. Uh, Spaba. This title roughly meaning army chief can be traced all the way back to the Achaemenid Empire. And during the Sassanid reign, there were four Spabads assigned to each corner of the Persian realm. Aha! I have really, really bad looks. Kulug! See, why can't I name him? Ah, oh, this game. I sometimes don't understand it. Kulu. Aman. Iran Ambaragad. Ambaragbid. To see the arms and armaments of the realm's warriors. You can assign a woman to it? No, oh, that's kind of odd. Yeah, 
Let's do it, makes sense. Lots of commanders. Ooh, look at Kostas. Now, Kostas is a, is a refugee from, from the Pechenegg realm. Sympathy for Pagans, but well, good because he is one. He's a poet. Oh, this guy's just an all around fabulous man. I didn't see his rating, so I apologize if he's really poor at fighting. Oh, what's the name? Kutluk. Someone do horrible. Trained to be a statesman, not a warrior. My other son, on the other hand. He's only 11. We have for wives. So let this go as I look for wives. She is a Zoastrian. Zoroastrian. I need someone with high display, diplomacy, just in case. Ooh, bright. Make it happen. Yes, yes, negative 300. But guess what? We don't have many high-born... Don't have many high-born girls for my people to marry. Will you fabricate this claim already? No, Costas died. He was such a good chaplet. Uh, oh, bump up to 11. Very good. Convert these heathens. Alright, this is my third son. Let's make him steward. Uh, yeah, Courtship, look. Uh, that's actually pretty good. Good, good. He needs a wife. Everyone needs wives. Daughter of my concubine and her ex husband, and who the cares? Ah. Good. Good. You has become a man. Yeah. Yeah, let's. Can I marry him to a Manichaean yet? If she's 47, that wouldn't be very good of me. Well, good. Find your own wife then. Yes, you are content. That's helping me out a lot. Well, there goes his army again. What the hell is he going to do? Oh, the warriors raised up. Where are they going? Yeah, another Kyrgyz war. Damn it. Can you stop taking over this land? No. I think that was my concubine. Uh, yes, I have one concubine now. To find another. Right within my court, of course. Oh, that would be bad. Poor for chief. Who? Oh, she's 42. That's not gonna help me with children. And my wife. 43. 47. 20. She's married to my chaplain. That would also not be good. I'm not running a cult here. My daughter-in-law. Well, I guess I shouldn't take her as a concubine. Oh, good. Your husband's dead. Okay, well, you're my concubine. Aha, uh -huh, Yeldam is pregnant at again. Which, uh, man. I am her man. <laughs> I 
want this trigger down here. He's got 24, just fabricated claim. It's clearly part of my realm. I mean, look at this. That's clearly north of this border. That's probably imaginary. We're going to keep on keeping on. So I'm still messing with the... Uh, Music settings, so hopefully it's better now. I know that the first two were a little bit, a uh, little bit loud. I got another daughter. Hunting again. All right. Everyone's having kids and babies and whatnot. It's good stuff, man. Awesome. So curry gaze is reduced to that. I'm gonna have too big of an enemy. Finally, 9.3 goal. Heck yeah! All right, let's get this show on the road, people. We're gonna try to see how quickly we can do this. All right, don't need him fabricating claims. Who doesn't like me? Vassals. He's starting to not like me again. It's something there to build him up. Now let's get the show on the road. What happened? No. I could have done a holy war all this time. Can I? Oh crap, I could have done a holy war all this time. What is care shot to show it to me? No, I guess not. Well, at least I have a legitimate claim. Well, there's a lesson learned. I could have been attacking all this time. To war! Do I have an ally? All of our vessels. Well, uh, I really hope that they will. Alright, let's see now. I have a build legend. Uh, no, I need him on the battlefield. I'm going to reduce that amount. And I guess I'll keep him there. Everyone goes to war. My people. Actually. Yeesh. Tell you. Need more men, clearly. Tribes go to war. Yeah, I'm a little bit OP up here. A little overpowering. Good, good. I like how it is. It's going to take me a while to get down there. That's good news. Yeah, this is not going to end well for you, Rabo. Ooh. Duke of Alte died. I need to call him to war again. That's kind of helpful. No, there's even more disillusion of my titles. Oh, no, wait. No, he's concubine. Let's get down and dirty. What's he going to do? He's hanging out there. Dude! Ah, 
O2 count revolt. That's what you get, moron. Expand it too far, too fast. I can still call you to one more again, though. go here, which I have no one to lead, but no one's leading that one either. Oh well. Oh, the revolt won't join me, huh? Alright, time to kill you. Buddhists fight amongst themselves. There we go. Uh, negative 20. Can't banish him. Just don't die, dude. I need you as my court chaplain. Wow, uh, that was a loss. That was a pretty stinging loss. I thought it's all good. About to take his land. Kind of makes his uh, tied up his army that they couldn't come down and defeat me. Oh, he has a city and a capital. This might end well up here. Yay! There's nothing I can do about it, apparently. I can't. I would have taken over in a holy war, but, well, who's this guy? She likes me. Can. He is going to marry you. Thankfully, we have a marryable woman. Uh, he is futile. He doesn't really hold help. He may get a little uppity. Still my holding though. Yes, yes, wrong holding type. Alrighty, well, that was a pretty swift one, I think. Next, we'll worry about. We need to build this up. Don't worry about that. Actually, I need to build up the market here. Spending spree! 
let's see. Another market? That would be better. I need more. I need more men. Alrighty, everyone. Well, thank you for joining uh, this episode in uh, Let's Play uh, for the Seo Cheyenne Achievement in Crusader Kings 2. Uh, as always, check back for the next installment. And uh, if you have any comments, uh, either they're good or criticisms of how I say things or how I talk or how I sound or how I play this game, uh, all are appreciated as long as you watch and just uh, it's an enjoyment to, to play this for you guys. So with that, uh, thank you everyone, and good night and good luck.